Hello. Hello. Hi, how are you tonight? Hi, hello, teacher. Hi, Ellington. I received your message. Okay, thank you. I'm sorry. Today is uh, no coffee. <laughs> <laughs> Um, yeah, yesterday, yes. Mm -hmm. Yesterday is uh, uh, working, working, uh, working uh, twelve, twelve a.m. Mm -hmm. In in my words, uh, need one program for installation and production next today for today okay i understand today. don't worry about it how is everybody else jose you're driving be careful <laughs> i don't want you to get in an accident or are you the passenger no i, I don't drive in ah, okay yeah I am the passenger. okay very good Estelle, welcome good evening hi Good evening. How's your day, Steve? Awful. Oh no, <laughs> don't tell me that. Why? It might work, but finally it's okay. So I want to forget my day in my work. <laughs> Let's not talk about that then. <laughs> okay. Let's begin the class. Well, okay. Uh, this is Thank you for time. asking. All right. No, that's okay. Um, so, we're gonna continue where we left off last night, right? This part, hold on. If you can see, please take notes on how to use just us, enough and too much to feel just as comfortable. So we have a lot of new expressions that we have to work on, all right? And at the end, I will show you the midterm because we have to complete the midterm during the weekend, all right? So let's do this. Pay close attention. Let's take notes. I'm gonna play the video for you. Okay, here it is. Tips that I'm proposing here, such as comfortable, convenient. About houses and apartments. Additionally, you we watched this video last night, didn't we? See the things are very similar. It's convenient. Yes, I, I, I think that that we saw last night. I think this is the same one. But um hmm. Where is expensive? Mm, houses are just mm, as expensive as apartments. Okay. Hmm. All right. So let's do the exercise then, if that's the case. Uh, what's number one? What do you think, Ellington? You're on mute, by the way. Which is which is correct? Mm -hmm. um, mm -hmm. um, in, in my opinion. House is a house are just as expensive as apartment in my neighborhood. Mm -hmm. Okay. In my opinion, houses are as expensive, but that is not okay because we're missing the other S. So it couldn't it couldn't be. S. Uh, mm -hmm. So that's not possible. What do you think, Jose? Mm, for the wish, which is correct, or my opinion for, for the Salvador? No, which one is correct? Okay. Things we need. The, the, oh, the, the second one. Second one, let's see. Houses are expensive as apartments. 
No, that's not possible because guys, we need the we need the burger. We need the hamburger. We need two of these. Okay. But okay. If we don't have two of them, it's incorrect. All right, let's see. So it has to be this one, right? Look, it says houses are just as expensive as apartments. We have two of them, yeah. Yes, okay. that is the right one. Don't forget about the hamburger S, S, and in between you have something. Okay, number two. And what do you think it is, Marie? Yes, teacher. Yes, no. what's the answer here for number two? My neighbor house has five bed bedroom, but my house is in as big as his. Yes, exactly. It's as big as his, exactly. Very good. Is isn't Maria. Because this one doesn't have two all two of them. So it's not possible. We need both always. So it's number three. Okay. Isn't. Uh -huh. Yeah, we need two always. So if you only have one, it's incorrect, okay? All righty. Okay, number three, Victor. Victor. Okay, Raul, you know the answer? Let me see. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. <laughs> the number trees. Oh. The first one option. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's the first option. Okay. I don't like to live in apartments because they don't have as many rooms as houses. Yes, and we have both of them, so that's good. Okay, and finally, number four. Raúl. You're on mute, by the way. So my new house okay. doesn't have enough space. No, because we have this, so it's something else. House is space. Mm, but space is not an adjective, so we are gonna have to use this, guys, as much as or as many as. So which one is it? Space, uh, is it countable or non-countable? As much. Uh -huh, exactly. So as much space much. as my old house. Right. Okay. Very good. Good job. Okay, don't forget that you need two of them and that will be fine. All right. Let's see next. Okay. Can you read the objective, please? Let me see who wants to read. Maria, go ahead. Uh, expressing wishes. And this dress is a big part of communication, communicating with friends. Mm -hmm. Learn how to express wishes that you have about your personal life, career, or health. This lesson from English teacher Joe Sainz explains how to use the verb to wish in the present, in the present tense, and combine it Combined? with a Combine its with a past tenses verb to express wishes. For example, I wish I didn't live with my parents. I wish I had a different job. Or I wish I were thinner. This lesson includes an, an oral language compre comprehension Com exercise. Comprehension? Okay. Very good. Oh, 
long objectives. Thank you very much. All right. So this topic is not so difficult, guys. This is going to be easier and you will like it. All right. But pay attention because we have to use uh, the past. Teacher, I have, a, I have a question. Tell me. And uh, the word I reach is the same that is, I want to say, I rather or is different. And no, it's different. Wish is like, um, like saying I would, I want, or I, I wish is the same in, in Spanish. It's desearía. Desearía que. In this case where it says here, I wish I didn't uh -huh. live Sorry, with I, my... I, I, um, in this example, what, what, what does it mean, mean wish? Sorry, I can, I can hear you. Wish is desear. Okay, in this example, it says, I wish I didn't live with my parents. It means, desearía no vivir con mis padres. Y acá, desearía tener mi propio apartamento. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Or in Spanish, we don't say desearía, we say ojalá. Like here, it says, let me see. Um, I wish they would stop worrying me. Uh -huh. Look, it says, La vida if, if I say I, I rather, I rather is. No, rather is a synonym of prefer. I wish were. Okay. Yes. Similar to prefer, so it's a different meaning because in, in Spanish we say, Jose, we say, Ojalá la vida no fuera tan difícil. That's what it says here. Life is difficult. I wish it weren't so difficult. So it's a different, it's not I prefer. Mm -mm. Okay. Yeah. Okay, so we have to use the past combined with this expression, all right? Write down the structure, please, everyone. Hello, everyone. By the end of this class, you'll learn how to express present wishes that you have about your personal life, career, and health. For example, you'll be able to make the following expressions. I wish I didn't live with my parents. I wish I had a different job. I wish I wear it thinner. Before I present the material, what I would like for you to do is to listen to an audio program that illustrates how this topic is used. Your task is to listen carefully and complete some questions that I'll have for you at the end of the audio program. So, are you still living with your parents, Terry? I'm afraid so. I wish I had my own apartment. Why? Don't you like living at home? It's okay, but my parents are always asking me to be home before midnight. I wish they'd stop worrying about me. Yeah, parents are like that. And they expect me to help around the house. I hate housework. I wish life weren't so difficult. So, why don't you move out? Hey, I wish I could. But where else can I get free room and board? Yeah, it's sometimes pretty hard to pay the rent. I'm thinking of finding a new job. Really? What kind of job would you like? I'm not sure, but I wish I worked somewhere else. I'm tired of this place. I need to live somewhere more exciting. I know what you mean. Hey, maybe we could move to a different city. We could even be roommates. Yeah, uh, maybe. Mm -hmm. Now let me start by presenting the structure. The first thing that I would like to point out is that we use wish plus a past tense in order to refer to present wishes. For example, if I have a situation that is true for me, such as I live with my parents and I would like for that to be something different, that is a wish that I have in order for me to express that idea. I will say, I wish I didn't live with my parents, or I wish I had my own apartment. Um, if I think that life is difficult, for example, this is my present situation. If I want to express a wish that I have about that particular situation, then I will say, I wish life were easier, or I wish it weren't so difficult. Let's try to make sense of the examples that are on this chart. 
in order for us to understand those examples, what I would like to do is I would like to propose this formula here at the bottom. And so what we want to do is we want to take certain situations that exist in our lives and then we want to express wishes about those situations. The example that is stated here is I live with my parents. I would like for that to be something different, right? And so in order for me to express that idea, I'm going to have a subject. So in this case, the subject is I, then this is going to follow wish plus the subject again. Now, the subject could be you again, or it could be another person, right? I wish I, and then the verb in its past form. So in this case, it happens to be that it's on a negative form. So we use didn't plus live. So I wish I didn't, and then whatever compliment, right? didn't live with my parents. There we go. There we go. And as you can see, the other example is quite similar. I wish I had my own apartment. In that second example, we can see that it's no longer in its negative form. So therefore, we're going to use the verb in the past. So the example will be, I wish I had my own apartment. So this is going to be in the past. So let's try to make sense of that second example there. I can't move out. So what happens there? I can't move out. The only thing that changed was that I'm using a model verb instead of a regular verb. Um, but what you got to remember here is that the model verb can, the past of that is could. And so it's basically the same concept, right? We're going to say, I wish. And then we're going to have a subject again. I wish I. So what is the past of can? Well, we can easily say that it is could, right? There we go. And so that's basically what we're going to put here. I wish I could. move out. Right. Now let's try to make sense of the example, life is difficult. As you can see, the verb that we're using there is the verb to be. And something that I would like for you to learn at this point is that whenever we express wishes, we're going to use where for all of the pronouns. It doesn't matter if we're talking about I, he, she, it, we, you, or they. For all of them, we're going to use where. And so that's basically what's um, here at the bottom, after which where is used with all pronouns. So if we think about the example, life is difficult, and we want to express a wish, then we can say, I wish, and the subject again, life, where easier. Uh, and of course, you can make that in a negative statement. I wish life weren't so difficult. But it's basically the same pattern that we're following. In the last example, my parents won't stop worrying about me. Well, what happens here is that I'm using a contraction there. So my parents won't stop worrying about me. In that particular case, I'm going to turn <laughs> will not into would. Right? So I wish, and in this case, subject my parents would stop, and then whatever compliment, right? What kind of wishes do you have about your life? And as I mentioned at the beginning of class, we want to express personal wishes. We want to express family wishes. We want to express health wishes. We want to express professional wishes, if you will. So I'm just going to have a series of wishes here, right? So what kind of wishes do you have about your bedroom? So an easy example, I wish my bedroom were bigger. What kind of wishes do you have about your school or job? Well, I wish my job were easier. What kind of wishes do you have about your appearance, the way that you look? 
Okay, we're not gonna discuss these. We're gonna discuss a different one. All right, let me show you. So that we can start practicing this topic. Basically guys, it's only wish plus past, right? Simple as that, okay? So um, first, don't pay attention to the structure right now, simply discuss, okay? Because I know you're getting a little tired, so you wanna get active right now. Uh, let me just open this. Or, hold on, why is it taking forever? Okay, there it is. Yes, rewrite the hum. It's one of these. Okay, that is a structure. Let me go down. Okay, this one, guys. Can you take a screenshot? I'm gonna try to send it to you too. So look, this is what I want you to discuss. Don't use the structure, nothing. Don't pay attention to that. Simply discuss the questions, okay? Which of these wishes would be easy to do? Is it easy to add more hours to the days, guys? Impossible, right? Is it easy to improve your personality? Discuss, okay? Which would be difficult or impossible, right? Check some of the things you would like to do Okay, so let me ask everyone. Well, mute the microphones, guys, everyone. Okay, raise your hand. I'm gonna ask you the questions here. Okay, raise your hand if you would like to improve your personality. Improve your personality? Okay, just two people. All right, who would like to enjoy life more? <laughs> just two, three okay very honest good okay who would like to find a better job raise your hand as an example <laughs> just three okay so the rest of you you're satisfied with the job that's good okay who would like to change their appearance change your appearance guys raise your hand Raul, no, <laughs> you haven't raised your hand, so that's why, not that, not that I have a problem with your appearance. <laughs> okay, so I want you to discuss those questions, all right, uh, here, and I'll send them to you. Okay, and the last question says, what other things would you like to change about your life? All right, simply discuss, and then we're going to use the structure. Any questions? No? Okay, so accept the invitation, please. Let's get speaking, check what's up. I'm gonna send it there. <clears throat> accept the invitation. Uh, image. Mm. We uh, wish at best wishes will be easy to do. Mm -hmm. Wish will be difficult or impossible. Let's start with the easy wishes to do. What? Yes, I wish. I wish that because I uh, always it's um, something to do. Siempre queda algo por hacer. Yeah. There is always something to do. Mm -hmm. Yes, so, I wish. <laughs> so you 
you wish that the that the day have uh, have more hours, twenty five or twenty six or Not thirty hours. Sorry, <laughs> sorry, yours. <laughs> okay. Thirty. Uh, okay. And uh, how about you, Victor? What was the question? It's a. Uh, uh, um, uh, yeah. I wish I have more hours today. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Yes, but don't practice with I wish because you have to respect the structure. Simply discuss the questions. Okay, which, which wishes are easy? And which we, uh, wishes are difficult? Discuss the questions, only that. Okay. Only the structure right now. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I think this moment in quarantine, uh, weekends, oh, and on um, end weekends. Mm -hmm. And you, okay. Mauricio? Okay, I, I think uh, I, I, uh, for me it's okay. It's it's twenty four hour. It's okay. It's the uh, I wish uh, I wish to. To have more time to to sleep more, mm -hmm. uh, to sleep more, but it's uh, twenty four hours. It's okay. Not it's enough. <laughs> it's enough time to to uh, to do all the things that we have to that we have to to do. No? How much hour do you work? How many? Uh, how, many how many hours? Mm -hmm. And uh, Eight and ten hours. It's most common. It's usually. It's usually that I have to work maybe the the between. For you, is difficult or impossible? Difficult. It's difficult. difficult. Okay. But I don't. I like my appearance. For me, it's okay. Yeah. And for move to a new house or new home, for you could be difficult or impossible? It's difficult because I am, uh, how do you say, um, the traditions me cuesta cambiar? Uh, Traditional. You can say costumes or you can say my, uh, costumes or habits. Depending on what you're talking about. Uh, Customs. My habits. And, okay. and change my home. I is difficult. No impossible, but it's uh, difficult. Okay. And for you, Tatiana, which which will be difficult or impossible? Um. I I change. Yes. No. Okay. Okay. I wish uh, visit. Um, I don't know. <laughs> Brazil, for, for example. I want to. I wish. I could be traveled to Buenos Aires. <laughs> Buenos Aires. Really? <laughs> yes. What part do you like to see? Excuse me? What part would you like to see? <laughs> uh, the obelisk. Uh, the obelisk. And obelisk. La Plata. Okay. Uh, uh, Boca. El barrio. Mm -hmm. mm. I'm in La Boca right now in this in this house. Uh, on Tuesday I was right next to the obelisk. Mm -hmm. uh, so send I'm a like picture. Really... And one a famous library. It, it's so beautiful. I remember the the name. A library or a theater? Yes. Library. So you have 
Teatro Colón. <laughs> ah, so... That's very famous because it's like really? luxurious, yes, and elegant. Mm -hmm. Okay, yeah. I guess we're going to go back now. Sorry, okay. Esther, you were saying? No, 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 I don't remember how the, how's the name of the library. I library have... is Biblioteca. Yes. No idea. I haven't heard of that. Maybe it's <laughs> I, Teatro I Colón. That's more famous. Really? Yes. Mm -hmm. Okay. Send me the name and I will send you pictures, okay? Okay. <laughs> All right. Great. Okay, here we are. And we were supposed to discuss the questions only, not using the structure yet, but in a little bit, all right? So now you have to use the structure. Look at this example. Diana can't wear contact lenses. So she wishes she could wear contact lenses. Look, um, if you are gonna use could, this verb has to be an infinitive. So the base form, all right? Dan can't fit into his old pants. What is the wish he has? What do you think? It's the opposite. We have to write the opposite, guys. Look, Diana can't. She wishes she could. So this is affirmative. Okay, Dan can't fit into his old pants. He, he what? It's together. Mm -hmm. He's bad. <laughs> okay, but imagine, all right, I, I can't or I don't have a cell phone right now. You're going to have to say the opposite. You wish you had a cell phone. Okay. So he, Dan, he wish, wish, or Dan, he wish he, f he fit. Ah, but then wish, this is third singular person. What do we have to do with the verb? Uh, then wish, then wish mm, he... Wishes. He could fit. Then wishes because it's the third person. Ah, uh, uh, then, then wishes. Wish, yes. He then could, wish. could, this is the past. He could fit. Into his old pants. Into Very his good. old pants, uh-huh. Yes. All right, what about this? I can't remember my PIN number. <laughs> So you're gonna say I. Uh -huh. I wish. Yes. I wish I could remember my pin number. I wish I could remember my pin number. Very good. Okay, number three. Number four. Laura doesn't. Oh, yeah, four. Laura doesn't have time. any free time. So Laura. Laura wish. Mm -hmm. No, but third person, you have I wish, you wish, she wishes. Laura wishes. Laura wishes. She have any time. Here we need the past. We need the past. Have time. Have. He has. She has. Has. Have in the past. More free time. Uh huh. More free time. For some free time. Free time. My parents can't afford a new car. So we're going to say, my parents. Mm -hmm. Which? 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 Right? Which? Which? They're. Uh -huh. They. They afford a new car. They, they could, could. They yes. could afford, they could afford, afford a new car. A new car. Heard it. Yes, that is the right structure. Okay. Well, that is what we have to do right now. We're gonna do some exercises. I will give you some sentences quickly, okay? Only four for you to modify, okay? The first one is, I don't have a car, okay? Next one is, we can't speak French, except Victor. Victor, speak some French for us. Go ahead. <laughs> You don't want to? Let me see. I don't, I, we're gonna say here, I don't sleep enough hours. 
Is that your case? Raul, is that your case? Mm. <laughs> <laughs> You're always tired. I don't. Okay. <laughs> and then we're going to say you don't live in a mansion. Okay. <laughs> that is impossible. Anyway. All right. So you have to modify this and use, you know, right? Subject plus wish plus subject plus past the same thing. All right. Can you do this? Let's do this right now. Let's work in pairs. Okay. Very simple. I will give you four minutes, one minute for each sentence. Okay. Maybe that's too much, but anyway. Okay. Let's work in pairs. And there, accept the invitation, please. Here Let's do this. Go ahead. Modify them. Mm -hmm. Um, or sentences. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, well, the first, I don't have a car. The opposite. Um, I wish I have a new car. Something like that, right? Mm -hmm. Yes, but the yes. car has to be in the past. Uh, put in cool. Number two, we can. Could is a past of can, but if you say have, you need the past of have. 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 I okay. wish <clears throat> I had. I wish I have a Maybe? new car. Or... Yes, yeah. very good, exactly. I okay. wish I had. Yes. See? Yes. yes. I don't have a car. Said yeah. I wish, I wish ha, have a car. I wish have a car. It's okay, teacher. I wish I, I wish don't. I wish I, wish. I you need dog, you need two subjects. Ah, right. it's two time I. Mm -hmm. I wish I had a car. Right, exactly. I wish I don't. No, no, no. No, no, it's no, dice, no, no tengo un carro. Quisiera tener uno. No va a decir quisiera no tener uno. So it has to be from negative to affirmative. From affirmative to negative, the opposite. Ah, mm -hmm. ah okay. Yes. Uh, the other is we can speak French. Sería... We wish mm -hmm. cold. We wish you a Merry Christmas. We wish <laughs> we, you need the subject again. I. <laughs> we wish we, I know. We wish we, we could speak we French. We wish we could. We wish, wish we could speak French. Uh -huh. We speak French. Tell me one sentence in French, Victor, <laughs> and one in Chinese. <laughs> I want to hear you. It's French. Uh -huh. Is that okay, teacher? We, we when, for example, and speak French. We can't speak French. Mm -hmm. We wish we couldn't speak French. Is that okay, Dad? We mm -hmm. could. Uh -huh, affirmative, because if you don't have money, you want to have money. It's affirmative. It's the you opposite. want to do. You want we, to speak. We could speak French. Yes, it's affirmative. Ah, okay. It's, okay. It's like ah, I wish I could speak French. We wish we could speak French. Mm -hmm. That would be okay. cool. Yeah. Hey, Mauricio, did you see the video? No, I couldn't. Why not? Really? Yeah, I don't. I don't know why. I couldn't. I couldn't to open the, open the the. The link. The link that you really? sent me. Uh huh. I couldn't why? open. It's in YouTube, no? Yes. Yes. But some people why. told me that that they couldn't open it. Uh -huh. I'm gonna send it to you again. Hold on. Okay. What kind okay, of? Okay, there it is. Maybe that works. Sorry. 
Okay. What is that video? It's a song. <laughs> but uh, yeah, Mauricio mm -hmm. was in the conversation and then I told him, I'm going to send it to you too. So I may send it to you, Victor, later. But listen to it later, Mauricio. Not right now. Okay. 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 So how many have you done? Two? Two. But we're three. I don't sleep enough okay. hours. I, mm. I wish you... I wish you could... Good teacher. Mm -hmm. If it's the if it's can, yes. If it's another verb, you have to use the past of the verb. Okay. What what is is don't is don't did that bear. No, don't is an auxiliary in that case. Uh -huh. What is the the sentence? I don't know. You don't live in a mansion. Hmm. The verb is live. So you have to put the verb live in the past. You wish you lived in a mansion? Yes, you lived then with a D in a mansion. Yes. Okay. Let me see. We wish we could have. I wish I had. I wish I. Yes. Perfect. Very good. Great job. It's excellent. All right. Yay. <laughs> All right, let's go. <laughs> <laughs> okay, well, this is what you should have, guys. Is this what you have? I wish I had a car. We wish we could speak French. I wish I slept enough hours. And you wish you lived in a mansion. Did you get the answers right? Yes? No? I have the, the, the second one worse or bad. Uh, this one wasn't correct. We wish we yeah. could, uh -huh. yeah, because it's can't. So the, oppo the opposite is can, and then uh, how to put it in the past, could. The right. first, I, I have mm -hmm. that the first. Mm -hmm. If you have lived, you say lived. If you say can, you have to say could. Slipped. If you have slipped, you have to say can. Is cool. uh -huh. Slipped. 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 This, uh, this is this is left. Eh. Okay. Right. Okay, guys. Look, pay attention. On this weekend, tomorrow we don't have classes. Okay. Ooh. Weekend. Woo <laughs> Yay! <laughs> this Monday. Well, no, you know, Friday, Saturday, or Sunday, you have to complete the midterm. Okay. If you have questions. I'm gonna write it just to make sure you're, you, this is clear. If you have questions, send them to the group because usually you have the same questions, all of you, okay? And before you ask, before you ask, check because maybe somebody already asked the same question. <laughs> Sometimes you ask the same question over and over, so check, check what's up, okay? If nobody helps you, well, you can uh, you can send me a private message, you can send me a message, or you can send, ideally, a message to the contact number. You always get a message, right? It says, guys, do you need help? Is everything okay? So you can send a message there in case you have problems. But I will give you, I will give you the answers, okay, on Monday. If you have problems, if you say, well, letter B is too difficult, I will help you on Monday, okay? But let's see, this is how you get to the midterm. Look, we haven't finished section three, all right, but almost. Teacher, so, mm -hmm. uh, please uh, review the, but uh, take a picture, please. Oh, we're here? Uh, yes. Okay. Right. Thanks. Okay. My pleasure. So look. After section 3.8, you click on next. Okay, for if somebody's new, this is how it works. I know some of you have been working for a year, but yeah, if you're new, after section 3.8, continue, 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 and you will see this letter A listening and it says midterm exam. Okay, so this is multiple. Oh, I lost it there. Midterm, midterm exam, here it is. 
listening part, you have one to three, you have seven sections, I think. The majority are multiple choice, so you shouldn't have any problems, okay? This listening, you play the audio here. If you have problems with the audio, click here, all right, on a separate uh, tab, and you can see it here. All right, and then you answer the questions. Same thing, guys. Okay, letter B, you have to choose multiple option, all right? Next, vocabulary, multiple choice, so it's not a problem. Used to, you have to write it. So if you have problems with this, let us know, okay? But this is the question for you. Did you used to play soccer when you were a child? So don't write all the expression, just the part that is missing, that is not in the exercise, okay? And letter E, you have to put these words in order, okay? It says fewer, should, noise, there, less, be, car. So there should be, right? There should be, and you choose the one that is in order. All right, next, indirect questions. Your favorite topic. <laughs> All right, so here you choose one of the, the one that is correct, okay? So everything is easy because it's only multiple choice. Do you have any questions about the midterm? Well, there's the reading. That's the last part. You have questions about the, the midterm? The midterm, well, that's it. We will use, we will, to complete that in, mm -hmm. in this weekend or in Monday? This weekend. This weekend? Yes, okay. by yourself, uh -huh. not in class. In class, if you have a problem with the, with the two exercises, well, I can help you. Okay. Mm -hmm. Any other questions, guys? Okay, we're going to discuss. This time, I need you to use I wish I, okay? But you have to use your imagination. All right. For example, let me see. Mauricio, help me. Okay. What do you wish were different about your bedroom? In my case, I'm going to say I wish. We're going to focus on the bedroom, okay? I wish my bedroom where or was, okay, bigger, okay? This is personal, but you guys have to change it. Next, you have to say, I wish I had another job, for example. So you have to create your own example, okay? My appearance, okay, I wish I was taller. So you follow the expression and make your own example that is real about this topic. Okay, we're going to discuss that right now. You have questions? Yeah, I have That's, a question. Tell me, go ahead. Uh, if, if I want to say uh, the, the sentences in the, in the past, I, mm -hmm. I will the was, for example, was bigger. Uh -huh. if I it's say better. Words, I, I wish now. Question. This is an exception. No, do you wish, you can make a question, but we're not practicing that yet. We can practice, we're gonna practice questions on Monday. So right now, just statements. But for, for a statement in the past? Uh-huh. Um, I, 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 we, we, we will use was or where. It's better to always use where, always even if it's I. Where? Or same in the past. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's an exception because it's imaginary. It's better to use where. Some people use was, that's the thing. So follow the structure, guys. Look, this is I subject, wish, another subject, and the past. All of them follow the same structure. Okay. Okay. So let's talk about this, following the structure. Talk about these topics. I'm going to make small groups of three, let me see. And I will be there listening to you to see if it's right. Okay, accept the invitation, please. There it is. And I'll send you a picture.
Yesterday you are sick. Ah, I. No. The word has something behind of you that says that you are. Have your day. No. <laughs> Uh, I forget. <laughs> <laughs> no. So what are we going to do? We will discuss the image that the, the men sent us to the WhatsApp group. What do you wish were different about all these things? What would what you, you like to change about your skills, Jose? My skills? Mm -hmm. mm, I wish... I wish I... I was a um, morning people. Uh -huh. I don't know. Yeah. And since you use it the exception, you would say, I wish I were a morning person. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. I wish I were a morning person. Okay, what would you like to change about your appearance, Victor? No, I'm okay with my, my appearance. What about your possessions? Um, I wish I had a new car. Uh -huh, very good. Okay, Diana, what would you like to change about your family? Try to change something so you use the expression. Mm -hmm. Thanks. No, 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 no. Okay. Uh, other questions, other uh, sentences, for example, um, I don't know. Uh, mm -hmm. What do you wish were different about your family? You have the questions here, right? So we're discussing one by one. Anything you would like to change about your family? Your job, for example. Mm -hmm. um, I wish I... Um, I job. No, you need a verb in the past. Ah, uh, sorry. I worked, you want to say? Uh, work, yes. Mm -hmm. um, I don't know. <laughs> I wish I worked for the government. I wish I worked in, in Canada. I don't know, something. You tell me. I wish I worked uh, in Salvador, for example. You don't work I in El Salvador, Elton? Yeah, yes, <laughs> sorry. <laughs> okay. Yes. No, yes. something that you don't have, something that, that you want to be that you want to be different. Okay, well, okay. let's see. Let's see with Raul. What would you like to change about your possessions, Raul? Change uh, about, um, about what? Your possessions. Uh, 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 I wish I. I wish I want change. No, no, no. I wish algo. Se quiera. Ajá. Ajá. I wish. I wish I. I change my car. I yes, change I wish, the car. The car. Uh -huh. yeah. I wish I had a new car. I wish I could buy a new car. Eh, any verb? Okay. For, well, some, mm -hmm. for example, I wish I have no, pass, uh, have. another have, have, have the, yes. another house, for example. Mm -hmm. Or I wish I had a bigger house, a big another house. house, right? What would you okay. like to change about your skills? Okay. Uh, skill. What mean skill? I forget. 
habilidades. I, so, I, I wish I had speak English. And I wish I spoke fast English. Okay, I spoke, spoke, spoke. Yes. I right. wish no. I had spoke English. No, I spoke, only that. I wish I spoke English. Spoke. Mm -hmm. Okay, we're going to go back now. Time is up. Okay. Okay. Uh, was it a little complicated, guys? Try to help. So so. So so. <laughs> Okay, and um, yeah, hopefully we can practice more on Monday, but this week can focus on the test, okay, on the midterm. Do you have questions? Any doubts, comments, something? No. Nope, all good. Okay. What's the meaning of midterm? Uh, midterm. Midterm is midterm. parcial. <laughs> parcial. Yes. Midterm. Mm -hmm. I didn't know that word. <laughs> Midterm, yes. And then you have final exam. Finales. Final exam. Okay, well, have a happy weekend. Enjoy it. Stay safe, all right? And I will see you on Monday. Take care. Okay. okay bye -bye. See you Monday. Have a nice weekend. Bye. Okay, bye. good night. Good night. See you tomorrow. Good night for all. No, tomorrow. Monday. No. <laughs> Monday. <laughs>